history has repeated itself. Last time there was for a capacity crowd, we drew 1-1 at Southampton. For me, that was a typical all you're going to know bed uh, team. Because once again, we go 1-0 down and we get an equaliser and we don't capitalise on that. Now, people are going to be raving about, oh, we've just equaled the Invincibles. Now, tell me how many trophies do we get for that uh, record to equal it? Uh -uh, zero. What did Arsenal got? One. And that was the Premier League. So I would have rather lost, yeah, I would rather have lost today. Because those records don't mean anything to me. You don't get a trophy for that. So it doesn't work for me. Not in the real world anyway. You know, the first goal, um, De Gea should be saving that. You know what I mean? You've got competition, son, with Dean Henderson and maybe even Tom Heaton, Heaton I beg your pardon, um, you know, over your shoulder. So if you don't put the effort in and don't make Malacra saves, your place is up for grabs. Because Henderson's not come on to sit, uh, to sit on the bench. And once he gets over COVID, he's got the best medical team known to man, by the way, so he'll be fine, then De Gea is in trouble. He should be saving that. I don't care if it took a deflection. You, as a goalkeeper, you save it. He could get near it, because it was close to him. At his near post. Like when, you know, Bartes conceded that goal against Ronaldo in the Champions League, got beaten by his post, and that was the end of him, by the way. He went after that, so we got Tim Howard in. And then we equalised Mason Greenwood again. And for me, that was only because Southampton lost the ball. It wasn't because of great play. It was scruffy, you know. And the Greenwood, you know, put it away. But next time, I just want to feel the performance more. It's not about how many goals you get. you got, you got to do more. And I think the boy's becoming a man. And I think he's got the tools at disposal to be whatever he wants. But I think his off-field antics he's more known for than on the pitch. But if he keeps delivering, then he's going to get better. Is he good enough for us in the current climate? Yes. Is he good enough to win us a league? No. And that was evident today. We brought players off the bench. And Sancho did nothing. A complete and utter waste of £73 million. Pounds, what we could have spent on getting a midfielder. But Torres moaning about Sancho signing. Why is Martial starting today? He just didn't do anything. He is redundant. Sell him in the next couple of weeks of the window. You don't change a winning team. Dan James didn't never run against Leeds. You know, so it's crazy. Sancho was a complete waste of money. And we're, gonna, we're finding that out now. He did nothing when he came on. He's not as good as Top West claim. You know, and Bruno Fernandes, that was not a foul in any way, shape or form, by the way. He's always going down like a bitch. He's always bitching and moaning to Owen Sundry. It's not... Uh, the players thought that got the ball that he was in the gym longer than you were. He's supposed to have that physique and he let the team down. You know, where's Bruno Fernandes love you? So, oh, he's a great player. Didn't do it today, did he? And Pogba got an assist. But as far as I'm concerned, he's only doing that because he wants a new contract. On the other side of the coin, he probably also wants it because he wants, oh, look, Real Madrid, I'm here. PSG, I'm here. So if you want me in January, if I don't sign a contract, then I can sign a pre-contract agreement. And these Pogba fans said, oh, everybody wants Paul Pogba. PSG fans had a protest because they didn't want Paul Pogba. So he's French, they're French, but they don't want him anywhere in the team. And they've got Lionel Messi. And I'll say this now. We should be winning every single trophy we're known for. But Ole Gunnar Nobed is a terrible manager. He needs to go. We're not getting any better. We're getting a whole lot worse. We're not going to win the league title. We're not going to win a trophy under this cretin. And I want to change. Bring in Conte. Bring him in. Winner. That squad, we win the league. We could have got Thomas Tuchel. We would have won the league last season. With him. All he should have been sacked when we lost 1-0 to Newcastle. When Newcastle got their first victory. He then should have got sacked when we lost against IB Leipzig. Or we needed one measly point. He just isn't good enough. And top reds can say whatever they like. They're all going, look how much we put past Leeds 5. And then we go and draw. I did say this. One swallow doesn't make a summer. I did say that you can't do that every week. And it's impossible because you don't have the right manager. And that's, and that's a shame. You know? And Varane still needs to get up to match sharpness. Lingard will not go to West Ham. I don't think they can afford him. You know, unless United cut the price down. But it was a poor performance. And I, I, I'm not seeing any improvement. I'm not. And that's as far as it goes, I'm afraid. So 
I'm off to watch Chelsea annihilate West um, Arsenal. So yeah, lots to ponder, but for me, the same old crap regurgitating over and over again.